all right guys welcome back to Jaden kitchen one more time again today we are going to prepare we will prepare some macaroni with some barbecue chicken I have a grill inside the kitchen I'm gonna prepare some lamb and barbecue it too but what I'm gonna do I'm gonna boil the boat first and I'm gonna as you see I already boiled some duck and I season it and boil it already and stick it out I'm not gonna make the video too hard because I have my duck to cook. But I show you duck curry already, but I'm still gonna make some duck today. But I'm gonna make some yellow rice later too. So in this video, this is the season that I have here that I already seasoned everything with. It's the garlic, as you see my green seasoning. I use my parsley, my dash, I use a little cube. My aji, my onion powder, my garlic powder, and I also use my black pepper. I season everything with the same seasoning today. As you can see it guys, the chicken is already seasoning. The lamb chop is already seasoning. And this is the shish kebab, the duck shish kebab. Already yes. seasoned and, and put in a, in, on a stick already. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna, I already boiled that, so I'm gonna boil the chicken now. To do boil up in the kahari, and then I'm gonna do my lamb. So let's get started. The, the chicken, we, before we barbecue it, we just pre cook it a little first. So you can burn out the little rank water from it, and then we just barbecue it. So we call it pre cook chicken, then barbecue. And I put my pot with my water for my macaroni, so I'm gonna make that first. Okay, my water is hot, so I'm gonna pour my macaroni inside. What I do, I add a little oil so it cannot stick. I'm gonna put my salt into my macaroni. It's like one and a half tablespoon of salt. And I'm gonna leave this to boil. Okay, this is how my chicken look in its own water. So when this finish, go down. I'm gonna barbecue it on the barbecue grill. I have a small grill, inside grill. We have a inside grill, a, a electric grill. That's what we go use. So we're doing an indoor barbecue today. Okay, as you can see, my chicken is boiled down. But you have a little water inside, like the oil that you lose, but I'm gonna put it back on the grill. So I'm gonna throw it out and I'm gonna use the same kahari to boil the lamb. Okay, as you can see, my macaroni is finished. So I'm gonna strain this out. Look at it, it's boiled already. So I'm gonna strain this out and I'm gonna fry up my vegetable, vegetable mix. Let me mix it up. Okay, as you can see, I'm gonna boil down my lamb. We are going to pre-cook the lamb before we barbecue it. I'm gonna fry my macaroni into this pot. Put my onion. I put some garlic. We have to cook the vegetable. So when I'll give you some green seasoning. So when we add the macaroni to the vegetable, then we will start to mix it up. Okay. 
As you can see, my onion is already fried for a minute or two, and my garlic. So I'm gonna add my vegetable mix. Add a little salt, not too much. Got to seasoning them, have a lot of salt. Okay, as you can see, my vegetable is cooked, and I'm add a little sweet pepper into it. And I'm also gonna throw my macaroni into it now. That's the mixed vegetable. As you can see, my macaroni has some season on it. It's the same season I put. The parsley, the dash, a little garlic, and I'm gonna fry it up. You could make your macaroni with chicken, but today by, I'm grilling my chicken and my lamb, I'm making it plain. And I'm gonna use a little butter to loose it up. What I do, I use, I normally cook this, this like, cook like chow mein. So yeah, I add a little of the Chinese sauce. And also add some cashew. You gotta mix that well so the vegetable and all the seasoning can mix into the macaroni. See how the macaroni looks. I'm gonna add some scallion I'm also gonna add some fresh parsley, fresh parsley. And this is gonna almost finish. Let's put the left right in this pot. You don't put any pot to the arm. Um, right. I add a little Chinese spice into it. Okay, as you can see my water is boiling so my macaroni is finished so I'm going to make some yellow rice you already wash your rice. I already washed my rice and I'm gonna do the same thing that I like, like the macaroni I'm gonna put a little oil into the rice and my salt I also gonna add this into the pot. That's the Goya yellow seasoning. That is the Goya yellow seasoning. So you can make it yellow. As you can see how the rice look, look at it. And when you feel it, you have to have a little grain. So I'm gonna turn this off and strain it out. And Jaden bring a little fun for me over here. As you can see, Jaden say the place is hot. Say grandma, look the fun. As you can see, 
all my rice look I put my celery my everything inside and my vegetable is frying meat you can make it whatever you want to make it with but I make it how I like it and I'm fried up I like fried up we put some kidney beans we put some green beans and some mixed vegetables and a little stove and it's just fried the rice is already seasoned with everything, so we go add it to the beans and we go fry it up. All right, guys. Earlier in the video, we was telling you about the indoor grill. This is the indoor electric grill, and this is what we're going to do our indoor barbecue with today. As you can see. The grill is on and we are putting on the chicken. Remember the chicken is half, already half cooked. It's pre-cooked so it never take too long to barbecue. This is the indoor grill. Um, you, you plug it in the wall and you turn it on up to 400. Dep depends how many heat you want. I'm going to do the chicken first. Then I'm going to put the dog. I think the lamb. You have to do the, the barbecue chicken, then you have to do the barbecue lamb, and then we have some shish kebab. But you make the shish kebab with duck. We already pre cook the duck before we put it on, on the shish kebab stick. This is the chicken on the grill there. You could see it cooking. This is the indoor barbecue grill. As you can see, I rub the barbecue sauce on the chicken and I'm gonna turn it over on the next side. Tell my chicken. This is like after five minutes of cooking on the grill we rub the sauce and then we turn it over and then we go rub the sauce on the other side this will not take too long because it's already pre-cooked and then rub my barbecue sauce mixed with ketchup Okay, as you can see, my chicken is well cooked and I'm going to take out my barbecue chicken. I have my celery, my onion, everything on it. After taking out the barbecue chicken, we will start to put the shish kebab on the barbecue. Mm -hmm. Okay, the lamb is already boiled properly, so I'm going to barbecue it. What mm -hmm. I'm going to do, I'm going to put a, a couple of pieces of that. But I just did it. Keep on checking on this. So I'm gonna put a couple. You cannot wait. Remember this lamb is pre-cooked already, also the fish kebab. Everything already boiled properly. So this is the indoor grill, electric grill, and we are using this 
to do our barbecue today. Okay, as you can see my lamb, I already put some barbecue sauce on it. And a couple pieces of duck. So I'm gonna turn this over. After turning over the duck, the lamb, right now, the, 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 the lamb, we will put some barbecue sauce on it. As you can see, how it's not enough. Cooked. Already cooked. And just rub a little more sauce on it. And let it cook a little more. And this I'm making for Father's Day. Yes, today is Father's Day. And happy Father's Day to all the fathers out there. As you can see, the lamb is already cooked here. I'm going to take out this set and I'm going to put the next set on it. And if you want to join us for dinner, you could come join us for dinner. Okay, I would like to say Happy Father's Day to all the dad out there, the father, and if you'd like to join us, you could join us to eat this food. Thank you and have a blessed day. Subscribe. If you like it. Hi guys, as you can see, my father they cooked today. My lamb, I boil it and I barbecue it. Well cooked. As you can see, my chicken and my duck, everything is well cooked. My onion, my pepper, my tomato is cooked. And look, I put some, some tomato here too. This is my macaroni and this is my yellow rice that I cooked today for Father's Day. And I also make some duck some duck curry and I make some rice. So Jaden is here with me today, but Jaden didn't help me in the kitchen today. Because what? Tell them. I was giving false day for Papa. Yeah, because he loves his Papa, so he spent time with his Papa today. So he says, sorry Grandma, you're gonna help me next week. <laughs> say it. Say happy say, Father's Day. Say happy Father's Day to everybody. Have a happy Father's Day to all the dad, to all the dad, and the father out there, the father to there. Okay, <laughs> and have a blessed day. And if you like Jaden Kitchen, you could please subscribe. Say happy Father's Day, Grandpa and my Papa. Happy Father's Day, Grandpa. Happy Father's Day, Papa. Happy Father's Day, Papa. And Mamu. And Mamu too. And Mamu too. Okay. Here we go, guys. This is it. <laughs> This is our Father Day cook today. And this is from Jaden's Kitchen. And if you guys like this video, please subscribe. Thank you and see you in the next video. Happy Father's Day to everybody. All the dad.